Hi there again, guys. A mini lesson with Mr. Beal. All right. We're talking about how to lose and still play safely. Sometimes it can be really tricky to do that. When, when, when we lose because we um, feel such strong feelings about losing and we want to win because it makes us feel like we're valuable and okay if um, we win. But what's so important is that we know that our value is not found in how well we do or what people think about us, but knowing that because we are valuable, so are other people valuable, and we have to know that innately we have value because we are a person. Being a human being gives us our value. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to talk about how to lose and play safely. Now, if things don't go my way, look, you see that? Looks like one person is celebrating and they won and this person lost. How do you think he's feeling? Probably pretty sad. You can tell because his hands are over his face, his head is down. He does not look like he is happy about what just happened. And then you got these two guys who are maybe arguing about who won or lost or, or something that happened in the game. So if things don't go my way, I will stop. It's so important to stop because when things don't go my way, sometimes we have such strong feelings we can do things that aren't safe, like yelling, screaming, hitting, different things like that, and that is not okay. So we stop, and it's good to have a stop word like chillax or stop or I need to go, something like that that tells our brain, okay, stop, what's going on? Stop yourself before you do something unsafe. Then we keep our hands and feet safe so we don't kick or hit or anything. We keep them safe. We name our feeling saying, I feel mad because I lost, something like that. And then we go and we take deep breaths and use self-talk. A good self-talk phrase for when we lose is say, it's okay that I didn't get my way. That's a good self-talk phrase for our brain when, we, when things don't go the way we want them to. It's okay things didn't go my way. Okay, so once we have kept our feet safe, we've named our feeling, we're taking deep breaths and we use self-talk, we should go find an adult to help us. And we can talk to the adult about how to talk to our friend that we, were had, that we lost to or had a, had a frustration with. And we, pro we use problem-solving steps like, what is my problem? Think about some of the solutions I can come up with. We explore consequences and then we, get, we pick a good solution. Okay? So... What I want you to pay attention to when you do this is what things make you upset when you, when you lose and to make sure that you use the, the steps to solve it. Stop, keep your hands and feet safe, name your feeling, take deep breaths and use self-talk, and then find an adult to help you solve the problem. All right, hope you have a great day. Another mini lesson with Mr. Beal.